Hi, my name is Anna, and I am a mom to two little girls. One is eight years old, and one is three and a half years old. And their grandma sent them a book called Change Sings. And I was hoping to read this book to you today. Um, Change Sings was written by Amanda Gorman. Um, so she wrote all the words and the book is illustrated by Lauren Long. So an illustrator does all the beautiful drawings. Um, and the words in this book, I think are so beautiful, but so are the pictures. And um, so it's, it's a lot of work. It takes two people to put a book together. So I'm gonna walk you through and talk you through the book, Change Sings. So here's the book. Well, here's the front of the book. Um, on the front of the book is a little girl who's playing the guitar. So um, I think it has something to do with maybe music or singing. And the back of the book is also very beautiful. And it looks like there's a, a street um, in the picture. And the back of the book says, I can hear change humming in its loudest, proudest song, I don't fear change coming. And so I sing along. So I think this has something to do with change and with music, maybe. But we'll find out. So let's open up the book. Again, this reminds us that the book is called Change Sings, and it's written by Amanda Gorman and illustrated by Lauren Long. So it says, I can hear change humming, its loudest, proudest song. I don't fear change coming, and so I sing along. And here's that little girl again, and she's playing her kind of big guitar, isn't it? And she's playing, I bet she's singing too. The words say, I scream with the skies of red and blue streamers. I dream with this, the cries of tried and true dreamers. And here is um, the picture. It looks like a building. So I think this is what they call a mural. So someone painted on the side of the building. And I don't know if you re recognize who this is, but that looks like Martin Luther King on the side of the building. Um, who's also probably talking about change. And here's our little girl with her guitar. And it looks like she's about to meet someone else who has, I, a, I forget what that is. It'll come to me, but another musical instrument. Trumpet? Maybe, no, not trumpet. Maybe you know. The words say, I'm a chant that rises in rings. There is hope where my change sings. So the little girl is meeting with the little boy who looks like he's found some garbage and the little girl has a garbage bag. So I think maybe together they might start cleaning up garbage maybe. We'll find out. So the next page says, though some don't understand it, those windmills of mysteries, I sing with all the planet and all and its hills of histories. So the little girl and the little boy are cleaning up a playground. So I think that's what they're, they're not only singing music and playing music together, they are making a difference and making change by cleaning up garbage that was at a little playground. I hum with a hundred hearts, each of us lifting a hand. So here's the little girl and the little boy. And here it looks like a mommy and a little boy who they look a little hungry. And look, the little girl is offering them some food. So she saw that they were hungry and she's offering them some food. This says, I use my strengths and my smarts 
take a knee to make a stand. So she is on her knees giving him food and offering food to make a difference and to take a stand. I am bright as the light each day brings. There is love where my change sings. So now the little girl and the little boy playing their music for this little old lady in her house. And do you know what I think they also did? That looks like a grocery bag full of groceries. And it looks like they're going and delivering groceries maybe to people who can't go out and get groceries themselves. So that's maybe the change that, another change that they're making and where their change sings. I show others tolerance, though it might take some courage. So look at this, the little girl and the little boy, they've met another little boy and um, he, the, he has a dog and the dog kind of looks a little bit scary, doesn't he? Looks like maybe the dog's barking. And then the little boy, he's plugging his ears. So I think, I think what it's saying is the little boy doesn't want to hear the music that the other little girl and boy are playing. And so I, I don't know about you, but if I encountered this little, the, the dog and the little boy who didn't want to hear music, I might be a little nervous. So I might have to be kind of brave. And what this is saying is it's taking them courage, but look, this, which is a trumpet, the little girl's handing him the trumpet and she's taking the courage, even though she might've been a little bit nervous, she's handing him a trumpet to sing along and be part of the music. I don't make a taller fence, but fight to build a better bridge. So look, they made friends and the other little boy has joined the, the, the girl, the little girl and the little boy, and they're helping another little girl who's in a wheelchair. And she has steps at her house and you know, a wheelchair can't go down steps. So it looks like they're making a ramp to help the little girl go down. And so that's the bridge that they're making together to help the other little girl and to make change. I talk not only of distances from where and how we came. So here are all the children now. They each have their own instrument and Look at this drawing. It looks like they're on a playground, but the drawing looks like the map of the United States. And the words make me think that it's telling us that even if we're from very different places, even then we don't, we're still part of change and we can make change with each other. I also walk our differences to show we are the same. I'm a movement that roars and springs. There's a wave where my change sings. Now look, they are all part of the singing change in a marching band. They each have their own instruments. And look, even the, even the dog. Even the little dog has a happy little face now. And I bet the dog, even the dog is singing along all because this little girl started with singing change. Change sings where? There, inside of me. So she's looking in her reflection and she's realizing where change sings because I'm the change I want to see. So she saw change and she saw stuff that she wanted to change. And what did she do? She's the one who stepped in to do something and make a difference. As I grow, it grows like seeds. 
I am just what the world needs. So look, that little girl, what she did, she inspired so many different people to join her and to also be the, the change, um, change things. I'm the voice where freedom rings. You're the love your bright heart brings. And she's once again giving another little girl an instrument to play and be part of change sings. We are the wave starting to spring for we are the change we sing. We're what the world is becoming and we know it won't be long. So now there's a mural of all of the kids who are part of that little marching band and who are part of the change sings. We all hear change strumming. Won't you sing along? So I think that this is one of my favorite books. And this book to me tells us that we are all, we all have it in us to be part of change that sings. So I hope you can all find it in yourselves. Even if you don't play any instruments, use your voices and be part of change that sings. Thank you for letting me read that book to you. Um, have a great day. Think about that.